Well, I started with Culture Breaking Around 2004. Um, it was my first taste of uh, real kind of hip hop, like real hip hop dancing. Like I was breaking before and I was doing like a bit of street dancing, you know, street funk at school and those kind of things. But me meeting Tim and Franco and all those guys that kind of pulled me into that world of, of a bit more kind of grungy hip hop, real kind of street stuff. And through that, actually, like with Tim and that, got my first taste of like um, interstate competitions and and shows and stuff, which was really good, kind of broadened my perspective of dance and, and threw me out there, so that was really good. I think one of the most unique things about Culture Break is they don't just wait, like, put out flyers and say, you know, come do class or something like that. But they actually reach out to the community, they go places, they do things, they, they find groups of people that possibly wouldn't have this opportunity and actually push themselves towards it so they actually get that opportunity rather than just kind of sitting back, being a dance school and just saying, we're here, come if you want. You know, they, they, they spread it out to so many different like, you know, uh, communities and stuff so they can actually have a chance to get a taste of it. So it was 2006 Expo. Um, they, they cast me as one of the lead characters. And so that was a huge thing for me. I mean, kind of always just doing kind of backup dancing or you know, just dancing in a crew to throw straight to the spotlight. That was a big challenge for me, but it was, it was amazing. It was one of the best things that happened. Myself, Tim and Matic, it was Mutu at the time, Mutu at the time, and Siri. We entered a competition, the four of us from Culture Break, and ended up taking out the Australia Comp in 2005, which was Battlegrounds, and that was a, a huge jump because no one from Canberra had ever kind of attempted competitions on like in Sydney or anything, and so it was really, really amazing thing to do. The legacy that Culture Break's left on me, it, it's it's kind of one of my foundations of where I come from because. I was doing breaking and street dance and stuff, but I never knew where to kind of take it. And so what they gave to me was a direction to focus it in and actually a push uh, to strive and, and go further and get my goals and, and keep going. I'm still doing it now, like I, I'm dancing full time, it's the best job in the world. And so without them, you know, it wouldn't be happening.